The Gila has a brown head. The Gila has a brown head. And it has... The, the ladder back has the black and white all the way up its head. That's all I know, and a Gila never does. That's all I know. seeing how close I could get. Right? And it's this camera. It's this I was like, is that are those trees or are those like groups of trees? Like I couldn't really tell. So here we are Buenos Aires, so we're in Arabaca. There's a Pyralexia on the ground here in a some sort of arroyo. And then we saw these little brown, tiny birds hopping around that were exactly the same color as the dirt. Have you got the Pyralexia here, um, Ed? I mean, my teachers, what they say is it's a red tail hawk until you can figure out why it's something else. So if it flies away, then we'll find out it's really something. There it goes. There it goes. Yeah, that makes it. Yeah. Okay, 
house and don't get mad at me. I'm just going to try to find it. Don't get mad at my house. There's birds there that's a little bit larger than the rest of them. But it looks like it's falls into a hole there. Mmm. Very interesting. Could it be one of those owls? Um, could it be a burrowing owl? Yeah, it could be. Wow. That would be awesome. I can't awesome. see it. It might have gone inside the hole that's behind it. There, Considering this is a wildlife area, it's not it's not unlikely. There we got some nice light on that sparrow. I saw a shrike. I'm wondering if that's a shrike. What do you think? Here's my picture. I can't see.